Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I have for you a hospice helping hands thrift store haul. Um, this haul was $15.80. I have the prices on a few of the items and that's about it. They, I don't, I can't ever figure out like what they're charging and they don't give you a receipt so I don't know. Anyway, so I found this really cute uh, a little plaque plate for the kitchen it says if you want to show me how to cook better invite me in your kitchen thought that was cute um, it was a green dot each dot um, is a different price green dots are dollar seventy five and um, this just kinda made me laugh if you ever been cooking and somebody said well if you do it like this it'll be better or if you had done this or add like if you can do it better you cook it then so anyway I picked that up um, so my kitchen right now is John Deere tractors and sunflowers I'm wanting to get away from that I've had that like motif or that theme in the kitchen for forever like we've lived in this house right at tw October will be 21 years that we've lived in this house and I'm wanting to get away from that and I'm um, so I've been picking up white white dishes instead of that what I have right now so I found this muffin maker um, it was three dollars it is oven and microwave proof I can't really tell what all that says in the middle um, but I picked this up I thought it was really nice. It's heavy, and I just think that it'd be good quality. I picked that up. Next, I'm starting to pick up these Cor Corel plates. So I picked up some with this like blue pattern on them. I'm not sure how much she charged me for this stack of them, but I did go ahead and pick these up. They had uh, different ones but some of them were scratched and um, really dirty and so I just picked up these and I will keep collecting all the different patterns until I have a whole set of uh, well, they'll be mismatched but I, I don't mind mismatch but they're all still when you look at them on the shelf they're all still be white um, next I picked up this card box I'm sure she charged me a buck for this. Um, it's a product of the United States of America. It's got two different sets of cards in it. I thought they were really pretty. Um, this is what they look like. And here's the, the blue one. So good for a junk journaling. I can pick those up next. I picked up some um, like recipe, older recipe books. This one is Home Candy in a Freezing Book. I picked this up just for like junk journal, ephemera, that type of thing. I picked up a, a Lassie book. Thought the pictures in it were really pretty to include in a junk journal. This is vintage. This is 1975. Picked that one up. And the t a book about the Texas Capitol symbols of accomplishment. Like I say, I love Texas history. So anything about Texas history is always going to catch my mind. There is a lot of pictures and so I will have to go through that picked up this ladies of the Methodist Church Matagorda Texas signed and tested recipes I picked this one up because it has got some really cool like advertisements in it like quite a few vintage advertisements so I liked that Next, I picked up this blue and gray cookery authentic recipes from the Civil Civil War years. 
I thought this was cute. Or not cute, but pretty cool. So I picked that one up. Here's another one. And a useful guide to herb health care. But this one's just got a lot of advertisement that you could use to make ephemera. The books were three for a dollar. Um, she probably only charged me ten cents for a lot of these books, but I went in and picked those up. Next, I found this a really cute Snoopy vintage Hallmark wrapping paper. Super cute. We love Snoopy. And I picked that up. Next, I picked this Julia Child. Um, mastering the Art of French Cooking. I picked this up thinking it would be really cool to use as a, a, a like a glue book or something. I liked the cover and the colors. So, 33 cents. The books were three for a dollar. So, 33 cents for this and 33 cents for this. Uh, it says 1953. It's got all the cards in it. It's been well used and well loved. And I picked that up. And I will tell you, we went to Canton over the weekend. They were selling these books. No exaggeration. 40 bucks. And I paid 33 cents for this. So, um, be mindful of what you're... What you're paying for, I guess, is the moral. This one's not in such great shape, but I think I can still use it for a junk journal. And last but not least, I found this pretty cute little, um, I guess it's a bust. And it was $2. I thought this would be pretty sitting on a shelf. She doesn't have any kind of markings on her, so I'm not sure. And I didn't look her up, but I just thought that she was sweet and I didn't want to leave her there. So I picked that up. But guys, that's it. That's my haul. All the items that I just showed you, I picked up for $15.80. So hope you're having an amazing day. Please give my video a thumbs up if you like it. Hit the subscribe button. Become part of my YouTube family and friends. I would love to have each and every one of you be part of my um, friends and family here on YouTube. Leave me a comment. I would love to hear from y'all. Um, thanks for watching. Y'all take care. Bye-bye.